Hi, Horns. Mr. Y here. Uh, this is number 44 in the EE book, Key Moment. Uh, it's a new scale for you guys. It's the C concert scale, but for you guys, it's the G scale, okay? Which means you're going to start way down low on that low G. I'm not going to try to play this because I can't hit that low G on the, on the horn. I will tell you that right now, but I will show you fingerings anywhere here. Um, if you find that you're really having a lot of trouble with the low version of the scale, I suppose you could play the high version, uh, but that does take you up to the high G, <laughs> which is pretty high too, so... Maybe I'll play the high version and you guys can get the idea for that. But you could play the high version or you could play the low version. Um, also, when I go to play the high version, don't get confused by my fingers because there is, I think, one that's just different, uh, a little different, so be careful. Um, anyway, though, the low version of this, you have that low G. That's the very first note there, the low G under two ledger lines. Uh, that one is no fingers on your horn. Da, it's going to be way down low. Okay. Um, the A, the second note up, of course, is first and, th first and second valve, just like a regular A. It is B natural, the third note, so be careful, ha, ha, ha. Um, your middle valve, not first valve, okay? Then we have uh, C and D and E, and F sharp is in your key signature here, remember, guys. So middle valve for the F, and then up to the D, okay? And then we all go all the way back down the scale, plus then the arpeggio. Uh, I think I will play the high version of the scale. So if you're playing an octave lower, I'm going to start here. I'm going to start da-da-da-da-da, and you're going to start da-da-da-da-da. Either way is fine, though, okay? It doesn't matter. Uh, here we go. version of that is pretty high. <laughs> um, but again, you can do the high one or the low one, whichever you like, doesn't matter.